Epithelial mesenchymal transition, known as EMT, is a physiological process during which polarized immotile epithelial cells give rise to apolar mesenchymal cells able to migrate and invade into the extracellular matrix. It is essential during embryogenesis, but when deregulated, it can play detrimental roles in tissue fibrosis and in cancer. Our study published in Cancer Informatics shows that EMT-related processes are linked to a broad and conserved program that is influenced by cell contact and adhesion. Using cultured human breast epithelial cells and mouse mammary epithelial cells, we performed experiments to assess the effect of differential density on transcriptional alterations. Microarray analysis of gene expression changes revealed density-dependent regulation of EMT-associated genes. More specifically, low cell density led to downregulation of epithelial markers and upregulation of mesenchymal ones. We next perform next biometa analysis, which allows comparison of one's given data set to a multitude of publicly available deposited data sets and identification of overlapping gene sets. In summary, we found that growing cells at low density induces transcriptional changes associated with cancer and DMT, with a phenotype more similar to basal subtype breast cancers than other subtypes, and associated with a less differentiated state. In addition, we tested how density-regulated changes are affected by MMP3, a known inducer of EMT, previously extensively studied in our laboratory. We found MMP3 to activate overlapping as well as independent pathways. Interestingly, we identified a subset of genes regulated by density, alterations of which were interrupted by MMP3. This effect could be induced if the proteins acting as sensors of cellular density for regulation of these genes were cleaved or blocked by MMP3. Among this subset of genes, we found a number of transcripts encoding a variety of RNA splicing proteins, including those that regulate RAC1b, an activated spliced isoform of RAC1, known to be a key mediator of MMP3-induced EMT in breast, lung, and pancreas. In summary, we have found that cell contact regulates a broad transcriptional program that is conserved between mouse and man and that is highly relevant to the transition from the differentiated state to malignancy. We also found that MMP3 induces EMT by interfering with the density-dependent regulation, causing the cells to retain their cancer-like transcriptional state even at higher density. These results point towards loss of cell contact as a critical step in the activation of the EMT program in the development of breast cancer. In addition, our study emphasizes cell density as a critical consideration in experimental procedures.